Hello, Dr. Glenn, resident vet for Vet and Pet Direct. Answering the question today, should I be concerned about my dog catching ehrlichiosis? Unfortunately, yes, depending on where you live in Australia, if you travel with your dog, or if you're buying puppies or dogs from interstate or potentially infected areas. Ehrlichiosis is a tick-borne disease spread by the brown dog tick. It has only been in Australia that we know of since mid-2020, and it was detected first in the top end of WA in First Nation community dogs. It has spread already in the two years or so since then to the top half of Western Australia, all of the Northern Territory. It's in the Mount Isa in northwestern Queensland and also the top part of South Australia. And there's been individual cases of pets Australia wide essentially that have travelled, including Victoria. Owners have taken pets on holidays or on work to those areas and have been infected and come back to their hometowns. Anywhere there's brown dog ticks in Australia, essentially this disease is probably going to spread to in the next couple of years. The current distribution of brown dog ticks is again most of Western Australia, most of South Australia, all of the Northern Territory, most of Queensland and the top half and western New South Wales and do get some inclusions down in Victoria as well, not Tasmania at this stage. So potentially a really big problem. It is a disease that causes potentially fatal symptoms within a couple of weeks of infection. We've got a podcast on ehrlichiosis diagnosis treatment prevention, which we'll link to in the show notes. But essentially, any dog that is bitten by a tick, within an hour or two, that dog is potentially infected. It causes bleeding disorders, immune dysfunction, uh, wipes out their immune system, um, wipes out their bone marrow, makes them feel sick initially, sometimes they recover, becomes a chronic state, and if it gets to that stage, it's unfortunately usually fatal. Can be treated with antibiotics if diagnosed early enough by your vet, but it's really important that prevention is the most important thing. So if you live in any of these areas, definitely prevention for brown dog ticks is most important for your dog. If you're traveling um, for work or for holidays with your dog into these areas, or realistically any adjacent areas to the current areas, really important that your dog is on prevention and needs to be thought about if you're buying puppies or dogs, um, rescues from interstate in any of these potentially infected areas. We as vets need to be on the lookout and also owners as well. Prevention, you need to try and stop the dogs being bitten by the tick and if they are bitten by the tick it needs to be killed as quickly as possible. We as vets are recommending dual protection essentially um, and insecticide which is pyrethrin that does kill ticks but it also prevents ticks so the Soresto Collar Advantix top spot every two weeks as per directions or Promoxin once a week as a spray is effective at preventing the ticks from attaching. The longer acting oral or topical medications monthly, each three months, each six months, that do a really good job on killing the ticks as quickly as possible is important as well. So dual protection most important. Bottom line, unfortunately it's a disease that's going to become more and more common um, through most states in Australia and it's going to kill lots and lots of dogs unfortunately. So keep an eye out, keep in the back of your mind, tick prevention really important. Hope that helps. Thanks guys.